Hey folks, Son of Beast here. I know, I'm so sorry guys because uh, we have um, we have so much of uh, game that I was just trying to upload these videos. But don't worry, we got more plenty of uh, presentations going your way towards the Stanley Cup playoffs of the NHL 22 and in real life here of Stanley Cup playoffs. Also with the NBA playoffs as well. And so the next matchup is about to be Toronto Maple Leafs and Tampa Bay Lightnings. I'm sorry guys if you can hear the noise in the background. That means the workers are putting a power wash here in the front of a house, in the back of a house. But hopefully it will be done soon before, um, before they finish it up and pack, pack things, everything up if, while the game is still in progress. So with that being said, I will have the commentators turned on and I will get started here for game time here at Amali Arena. And then game five will be rematching here again while we already have seen the, the Rangers and the Penguins finish their game as there won't be a chance to go back to Madison Square Garden. They will have, the, they will have a chance to take a opponent on against the winning team in between the Hurricanes and the Bruins. So, with that being said, let's get started here at Amali Arena to start the presentation. Hope you enjoyed the game, guys. Right now, the series is 2-1 of Tampa Bay in a lead. So let's get started off here in Game 4 to do it again. Will the Lightnings win or the Maple Leafs win? Find out. And the commentators are all set on the board. Take it away, guys. Eastern Conference action is on the agenda tonight here for EA Sports. Hi, everybody. I'm James Sabalski along with Ray Ferraro. Welcome. Setters glide into position for the opening draw. The Leafs start with possession as we are now underway. Moves it quickly over to Matthews. Moves the puck. Couldn't complete the pass. The Leafs have it in the offensive zone. Oh, and he just gets a piece of it. Great extension on the play. Takes the puck along the boards. A chance! Oh, to nice up with the paddle save! Yeah, he got up tight to him, James. There's nowhere for that puck to go. And he connects with the long bar. Here's a shot. Oh, he got a piece of it to keep it out. Takes a wrist shot. Gets in front of it by laying out. Dismiss that chance. They work the puck in the... Scores! The home team's on the board. And that is a textbook start for a home team. Get the early first goal. Make the road guys start to chase you. He can be so effective when he makes those great passes. That's his third eye superstar ability. And he helped set up that goal because of the way he distributed the puck. Handles the puck at the point. chance they work the puck into position and it's a scoring chance it's turned away and he comes up with it taken by Lindgren through the middle of the ice they enter the attacking zone with the stop Tampa Bay's got the puck inside the defensive zone moves it to point to the front slotted aside by the blocker and the goalie covers up for the whistle We're still in the early stages of this period. The Bolts have taken a 1-0 lead. Sorelli's won the draw here in the offensive zone. Scooped up along the wall by Kasha. With the stop. The Lightning have gained control of the puck in their own zone. Takes the feed. Big blocker stop by Campbell. Scrum on the horse, they battle for the puck. The Bolt's going to work on offense. Tries to the sweet spot, but picked up by Riley. From center, they get into the attacking area. And there's the save. Vasilevsky's going to cover it up and get a whistle. Even with the traffic starting to close in, he had to grab that when he did. Hope you guys didn't get me in a picture. No worries. 
You won't see me uh, interrupted anyway, so uh, I'll be all right. That's kind of tight over here. It's 2-0 the Bolts. Bolts goal! His first goal in the playoffs, scored by number 44, Jan Bruda. His first assist by number 23, Aaron Pellero. Time of the goal, 4.55 remaining in the first period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Let's go, Bolts! Toronto goal gets first goal of the season, scored by number 34, David Kroll. His first assist by number 44, uh, Kronkun, and by number 15, Aaron uh, Kevin. Time of the goal, 4 5 48 remaining in the first period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. His third goal in the playoffs, scored by number 73, Austin Matthews. His first assist here by number 44, Aaron Kerman, and by number 37, Kerman. Time of the goal, 6.43 remaining in the first period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Toronto's got a one-goal lead here in the first. What's the message on the bench, right? 
the message is to be aggressive, to get another one, to try and stretch a lead that you've just built. Toronto goal gets his first goal in the playoffs, scored by number 78, TJ Brody. And it's assisted by number 24, Carlos Kervin. Time of the goal, 9.38 remaining in the first period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. They're still getting there. They got to find another way to stop them. The Leafs win it in the defensive zone. Hooked away in the offensive zone by Kucherov. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. Takes a shot. And the Leafs bond up blocking that. Toronto's got the puck behind the net. Quick pass over to Nylander. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Oh, I stick craters on him. So disappointing. There's $300 you won't get back. He's not paying anyway. On target! Toronto's got it in their own zone. And the intensity's starting to ramp up here after that hit. Taken along the wall by Kasha. Toronto's working the transition through the middle of the ice. Grabbed along the boards by Tavares. Rocked up in the open ice. Puck picked up by Pilat. Moves inside! Toronto's got the puck. Moves the puck along the half wall. Denies him with the pad. Tampa Bay's got a hold of the puck now. Nice pass. The Leafs move to the offensive zone. Wrists one. Nothing happening on the miss. Oh, he's got to get it on the target. Doesn't matter how hard you shoot it. If the goalie does not to make a save, it's not even a chance. They go on the attack through center. Sends a pass over. The lane was plugged up and that shot's blocked. Let's it fly. Plus save. There's the whistle. We'll get a face-off after the goalie covers up. Matthews uses a quick shot to score after deking towards the blue paint with his shock and our zone ability. Hedman's a star defender on his team's blue line. I'm expecting one of these players to make a big difference for their team before the game is over. Back to you guys. Sends the pass over. He scores! Shoots right in. So rebound and puts it in the back of the net. Mark in this period, we got a tie game. Holt's goal, his first goal in the playoffs, scored by number 14, Patrick Maroon. His first assist here by number 41, McCarron. And by number 27, Brian McDonough. Time and a goal, 13-42 remaining in the first period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Let's go, Bolts! The wing the attacking area. Toronto's got control of it now from their own end. Gaining momentum along the wing. Puts it towards the net, off a stick. The Lightning have the puck against the boards. Across the line from center. Driving right to the front. Great save from in tight. Oh, he had to get up tight to the puck. In close, he takes away any room. Moves it quickly over to Chernak. And they're off to the races for the loose puck. Toronto's got a hold of it against the wall. Moves it to Barker. Love save made by Vasilevsky. Chernak's taking it from his own end. Sends it in deep. Toronto's gained possession along the boards. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Throws it in. The Lightning have the puck in the defensive zone. Tampa Bay's across the blue line. The Leafs will play it from the defensive zone. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Gains the zone through the middle. A chance right in front. Oh, and it stays out. He got a piece of that one. Yeah, he looked up to the roof after that one. He thought he had room. The goaltender makes the stop. The Lightning 
indeed control the puck along the wall. And now they look to make something happen from the neutral zone. Cross into the paint. Too much congestion blocks the shot. Toronto's in transition. Ducks it into the ozone. Tampa Bay's got a hold of it along the wall. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Points got it against the boards. Oh, puck doesn't get there. It's so crowded in front of the goaltender. Quick stop by Campbell. There's the whistle as the puck is frozen up. Getting into the later stages of this period. We are all tied up in this one. Back underway, they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Denies him in front. And as he opts to freeze the puck, we get a whistle. Starting to look like a little bit of a fire drill in the zone, so this is a good play. Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. Tavares wins the draw on their own end. The Leafs have it now. Gaining momentum in the Last minute left in the first period. Been going on between Canada and USA. We'll be right back with you. Second period's coming up after this. We are about ready to get underway here for the second period. If you're a fan of defensive hockey, this one isn't for you. All tied up. It's been an offensive loaded game so far. Ray, we've already got 20 minutes under our belt here. What are your thoughts on this one so far? The Leafs are going to want to turn the page on that ugly first period. Way too many turnovers. Lucky the game's tied. And going forward here, OJ, there's an easy pack. Get the puck, hold on to it. Wrist shot from the slot. Stop it! And they go up by one. Tied no more. That's a big goal to be able to take the lead. His pass was right on target and helped set up that goal there. That's his tape to tape superstar ability. And it was a pass that was not only accurate, but easy to handle. Toronto goal, his first goal in a playoff score by number 49, Michael Bunting. His first game, Michael Bunting. His first assist here by number 44, Colin Crucho. And by number 16, Colin Griffin. Time to goal, 52 seconds in the second period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. First goal in the playoffs, scored by number 91, John Taverns. His first assist here by number 18, 8, oh, Lindro. And by Lee Lander. And by number 25, Aaron Time and a goal, 3, 342 remaining in the second period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Game possession off the wall. 
What's an open space at center? Rocks him on the play. Riley's lugging the puck. Puts it on net. Oh, I thought he was going to be beaten, and he somehow got a piece of that. Great defensive effort with the stick. Scrum along the boards, they battle for the puck. The Leafs gain possession along the wall. Toronto's got it against the boards. Quick shot. Fantastic save. The Lightning have possession along the boards. The Leafs ready to go on the attack. He scores! Jumps right on it, so rebound and puts it in the back of the net. Guys, he used his superstar ability to create that scoring chance and skates away with the goal. What a great play by him. Toronto goal, this first goal in the playoffs, scored by number 18, Michael Mariner. Time of the goal, four, time of the goal, four minutes, 43 seconds, 52 seconds in the second period of a Stanley Cup playoffs. Assisted by 18 on Payla. Time of the goal, 436 remaining in the second period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Let's go, Bolts! Assisted by number 27, Claude Lufon, and by number 91, Tom of the Goals, school, 12 minutes, 3 39, 39 to go in the second period of the, power, of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Play. Into the middle of the neutral zone. 
We got the viewers on the floor uh, on ice. Tavares is going to take some attention from the therapist as it looks like he's banged up after this huge hit. Yeah, it looks like that Tavares is out. He's going to have to talk to the therapist. Some last second communication before both teams get ready to drop the puck here. That's a disappointing effort for Toronto. Tampa Bay's got it in the offensive zone. Oh, just gets a piece of it with the toe stop. Campbell's opted to hang on to the puck for a faceoff. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. Puck scooped up by Cooper. Great hit. Still more time left as it's right now passing the midway period. Matthews wins possession in the defensive zone. And now it's over to Bunting. Nice zone entry on the left side. Takes it to the net. Oh, what a blocker stop on that. Vasilevsky's fought that puck all night long. He makes a good save there, James, but it's been a long night for him and the guys in front of him haven't been much better. Still lots of time here for Tampa to get a goal. It's 7-4 game. Belmars won a big draw on their own end. Down the right side and into the zone. And here's a shot. Makes the save and he got a blocker on it. Toronto's moving it up the ice. Cuts to the paint. Oh, he scores! Austin Matthews clutch. Toronto goal, his fourth goal in the playoffs, scored by number 458, Michael Bunting, Austin Matthews. His first assist here by number 34, Monty Matthews, Michael O'Reilly, and by number 37, Twin Oakrun. Time of the goal, 12 for 14, 39 remaining in a second period in the Stanley Cup playoffs. And now he moves it quickly to Stamkos. Cut it to the slot. 
Nowhere for that shot to go through. Toronto's got the puck in the defensive end. The Leafs are in transition. Oh, what a hit on the boards. Now into the offensive zone from the right side. From the point, looks to make something happen. From the point, and a strong defensive effort to get in front of that. Tampa Bay's got the puck along the wall. Nice dish from the left wing. Moves into the slot. Oh, serves up waffles for dinner with that stop. Up along the wing. Marner's got it into offensive territory. Here he is from the slot. Oh, and he somehow got a little piece of it, and it stays out of the net. Works it across to Palat. Now a quick pass to Sorelli. Slides the puck across to Kucherov. Here he is in close. Turns it away. I think it's a chance for a breather here as he hangs on and covers the puck up. Who, for the players or for you? Well, you know, I won't complain. Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. The Leafs gain control of the puck. Quick feed to Barner. Toronto's got it across the line. Last minute left in the second period. Less than a minute to go here in the middle frame. Grabs the puck in the corner. Off a stick and they can't connect. From the left wing takes the feed. Here's a short pass to the lot. Just wide. Sends it over to Simmons. Gains the zone from the right side. Takes the puck into the corner of the offensive end. And there's the horn bringing the second period to an end. All right, they say three is the magic number. Period number three is coming up next. Well, that should do here for the second period. The third period will be underway when we come back. Don't go anywhere. Final period left. It's time to get rolling. Welcome back, everyone. He's Ray. I'm James, and we are ready to kickstart this third period. Third period underway here. This has been a total squash to this point. Once again, I'll send it back down to my broadcast partner, Ray Ferraro, who is at ringside. Ray, we've got two periods play. How do you see this thing? The both coaches have just gone up and down the bench reminding guys, get to the front of the net. More pucks there. I think they like a lot of their game. They just haven't scored. Receives the pass. We're going to face off after the puck stays covered up. And both centers glide into the dot as a face-off set to resume. Toronto's won the draw, no go to work. And he makes the save. Elliott's able to make the save, and on top of that, deflects it out to the corner. Quick pass across to Kucherov. Toronto's got a hold of the puck now. Handles the puck. Knocked away. The Lightning have the puck in their own zone. Kucherov's got it in the defensive end. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Snaps one here on the slot. Campbell's going to slow things down and opts for the whistle. He's had a really good night. He's been on top of his game, and there's not been much that's given him trouble. Still much time left here for Tampa. They need to get something else done. Into the attacking zone from the right. Gets the full use of his. 
the stick on the poke check. Takes the shot. Campbell is going to smother him to get a whistle. Can get dangerous if nobody's in control of the puck. The centerman glide into position. Sorelli's won the draw. Turned aside with a glove by Campbell. Move to the middle. Snaps it on the Misses that by a wide mark. I'm not sure how he ends up delivering the puck like this. Scores! The captain comes through! Tampa Bay's got to be thinking more and more offense here now in the third. No reason to sit back. You're in a hole here. You need goals and you need lots of them. Attack. Bold score! It's first score in the playoffs. Scored by number 18, Steven Stamkos. Assisted by number 53, Heinz Redman. And by number 17, Dave Truman. Time of the goal. Four minutes, 33 seconds in the third period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Let's go! Bolts! Toronto's won the face-off. Lays out with a block. How can it get up? Oh! Toronto's got the puck. And that's picked up by Kucherov. Here's a shot. Oh, gets a little piece of it and keeps it out of the net. Takes the feed. From his own end, he moves it up ahead. Lets it fly. Turned aside with a glove by Elliott. Ref blows the whistle as the puck's covered up. Still more to get there. Game five will be coming up very, very soon once we have it all covered down. Play reserves that win the draw here inside the offensive zone. And now he tries to get it across to Bunty. The Leafs played along the boards. And that's knocked away by Point. Tampa Bay, he's got a hold of it along the wall. Through center. Snaps it under the net. And the goaltender comes up on a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Toronto's got the puck inside the defensive zone. The bolt scooping up along the boards. Time of the goal, 6.20 seconds in the third period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Let's go, Bolts! Campbell's going to hang on for a whistle here in the third. Well, there's not much time left here as you get into the final 20 minutes. The game's close. A mistake now would be critical. The officials are in position, and both teams are getting ready as they get set for another face-off here. Tampa Bay's won the draw. The Leafs gain control of the puck against the wall. Fires it into the offensive zone. Hitting up along the boards. Tampa Bay's got it in their own zone. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Ruda. The Bolts carry it along the wall. And now he angles it across to Kalorn. Toronto's got a hold of the puck. There's a hit on the play. Stopped by the goaltender. The Lightning have gained control of the puck along the wall. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Nice save by the keeper to trap that puck to his chest. Still more time left. You know, game five, the first game will be happening here at LA. Make sure you keep your eyes on that one. Will play it in their own end. Quick pass to Nylander. Slides the 
puck over. Gains the zone from the right. Here's a shot. Oh, that's a big time save. I think he got it with a toe. Tampa Bay's got it in their own zone. Here's a shot. Too many bodies in the way. The Leafs have it behind the net. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. The Leafs looking against the half wall. Quick shot. Oh, fantastic save by Elliott. Quick feed to Perry. Oh, good slot of the puck to knock it down. Oh, what a save in front. Sometimes you make a good shot, you just get beaten by the goaltender. I'd say that's one that you put in that category. Oh, that was such a big hit, James, that solidly planted. He's just struggling back to the bench. He wants to get his win back. The Leafs have it now. Moves it quickly over to Nylander. Here's a chance. Scores! His second of the night. Well, things go well for you if you score multiple times in the game. This has been a terrific night for him. Toronto's taking a playbook out of the Ray Ferraro school of hockey here. Just be aggressive. Go on your bed when you score. Go get another one. Toronto goal is second goal in the playoff. Score by number 817, Michael Mariner. Mariner. It's, it's, it's first assist by number 44, Tolkak, and by number 16, We've seen just about every type of goal so far tonight. Time of the goal. Of a game that's going to get locked down anytime soon. Sorry. Uh, time of the goal, 14, 13, 42 remaining. It has third period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Toronto's won the face-off deep in their own end. The Leafs move it ahead. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Nice pass. And he slides it quickly to Palat. Here's a shot, and he comes up with it. He'll keep it alive and moves it ahead. Inside the offensive zone. And he puts that one aside with ease. And there's the whistle as he elects to slow things down a little. A pretty good decision here with the play starting to break down in front of him. The Leafs win the faceoff. Let's it go! Can't get it to go. Kalorn's got the puck along the wing. Puts it on net. Stopped by the goaltender. Oh, and serves up a little too sweet with that save. Puck picked up by Kalorn. Here's a shot denied by the goaltender. Goaltender covers up, we got a stoppage in play. There's still more time left here for the bolts to get right through it, but the time is ticking away. Toronto's got it in the defensive zone. Riley's taking it from his own end. Puck moved over to Marner. Ahead of steam now towards the front. To the low slot! Tampa Bay's got control of it now from their own end. Enters the offensive zone from the left. Trying to engage a little physicality here. And now it's grabbed by Martin. Toronto's on the attack. The Lightning have gained possession off the wall. And now he moves it to Stamkos. And he'll take a moment to regroup back to center. Takes the feet at the back end. Puts it wide in the net. The Bulls are looking for a way back in this game. They continue to get scoring chances, but late in the third period, they can't find the net. Tampa Bay has got the puck. Here they come up along the wing. Sends a pass over. We got a whistle as the puck's frozen. Play set to resume with the face-off ready to go. The Bolts will go to work here in the offensive zone. Denied by Kimball. And we get a whistle as the goaltender decides to hang on to this one. 
Carly Bain is standing by with who had the better night. Matthews was rewarded for his efforts by getting in on the scoring. I like how focused he's been, and I'm giving him the edge tonight, guys. Motion to pull up. What a steal in his own end. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. And he regains control of the puck. Loves the puck into the corner of the offensive zone. Oh, what a stop with the blocker by Elliott. Tries to feed it over to Pallott. Into the offensive end now. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. He scores! Now it's only a two-goal game. Also, it gets progressively better for them, but they need another one. they got to throw a three back-to-back -back goal up here. He made a great play and used his superstar ability to score that goal, guys. That's a great example of how we can produce for this. Bolt goal! His second goal in the playoffs. Score by number 20, Braden Point. Is assisted by by number 18, Garen Pollock. Time of the goal, 18:43 remaining. 18:22 remaining in the third period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Let's go, Bolts! wants to produce for his team to try and close the gap on the scoreboard, guys. He can use his zone ability to get those looks, so let's see how he responds here. Almost down to the final minute. Last minute left in the third period. Pass to Nylander. A shot into the Yanni cage. And there it is. Empty netter. That'll seal it up. Pretty easy one right there for him to catch it. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Toronto goal is third goal in the playoffs. Scored by number 88, William Nylander. And it's persisted by number 3, TJ Randy. And by number 22, 25, Aaron Gorman. Time of the goal. A left time and a goal, 1904 remaining in the third period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Thanks very much for the update, Ray. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Takes it across the blue line. Unloads one. Oh, he stops him with a glove. Great reflexes there. Puck sent over to McDonough. And now he tries to get it across to Kalorn. A chance from the slot. Oh, denies him with the paddle save. Almost running out of time right now. Only 19.4 seconds. Camps won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Takes the feed from the left side. Moves it around along the half wall. Stopped by the goaltender. They work the puck into a scoring spot, get a pretty good chance on goal. They just can't find a way to finish it off. And we are all over with this one. Toronto's game had a lot to like this evening, wouldn't you say? You score that many goals, you can find plenty correct. Yeah, they would like to have the puck a little more, but ah, that's for another day. Uh, that's nitpicking, isn't it? Oh, it is for sure. Well, this one's in the books. A fun one tonight for Ray Ferraro. My name is James Sabalski. Thanks for joining us, everyone. Good night. Wow. The biggest disappointment ever was turning out to be just one. And I'm telling you why. That's because the Toronto Maple Leafs are looking for a fresher to try to revenge someone here for tonight. Well... Now you knew this was all that happened to turn to be a 2-1 game, but now the series is tied. Final score, 10-7. What a play here for Toronto Maple Leafs. Let's check out your three star players of the game. Starting off with number three, we have is Timothy Lillijuren with four assists and two hits. Then it's William Nylander, two goals, two assists, and one hit. That all took it. And it was going to happen here just like that before. And for the number one star, this one goes to Mitchell Marner. Two goals, three assists, and one hit. What a play, it stops. And that's all it does turn out.
So I'd like to thank you all for watching for all the game for of each games here at the Western and Eastern Conference of the Stanley Cup playoffs. We will have the next matchup as we will have the back into the uh, Western Conference to start things off of Kings and Oilers here at the Crypto.com Arena. Then the second one we have is the uh, amazing show ever to start things off to do things again from the top as you will have the Hurricanes and the Bruins here at the PNC Arena. Then the next one we will stick around here later as we will have the Wilds and Predators back at XL Energy Center of the Arena. Now we wanted to get back into Game 5. And then we will stick here on number one for the Eastern Conference of Toronto and this one, Toronto and Bolts, here back at Scotia Bank Arena in Canada. Right now the series is is taking over a 2-2 here for the tie series, as I just said before. And then the next game, well, we got something else out there. Avalanche and Stars at Ball Arena. And this next one will just bring out a shot. The Panthers and the Capitals at the PBNT Center, but we're not sure what stadium is it going to be renamed. Well, stick around here for next uh, season, and there might be something going on if there's any changes from here. So, I guess that does turn out to be just that. And yes, we can't forget about the Calgary Flames and Blues. That's for the next game that will be happening here back at Scotia Bank Saddle Dome. Just like uh, Scotty Bank Arena, but this one's a little bit more different. So thank you for watching, and for just a bit on the other side right now, we have a lot of them to keep an eye on for this part of the game. Thank you all for joining us, and stick around for Game 5 soon. Until next time, peace out everyone, for a while, as the NHL 22 of the Stanley Cup Playoffs. This is Son of Beast signing out. Have a wonderful night here at the Bolt of Tampa.